What's up, everybody? It is Crypto Muscle, the worldwide phenomenon, the madness that's happening in the cryptoverse. That's what it's about right now. But let me fill you in on some things on what's been happening in the cryptoverse. So before I get to here, let's see what's going on out there. Aha, look at this. The Oracle $100,000 Bitcoin to ETH to deposit into ETH gold. Oh man, that's going to be huge. And that's the rage right now. Look at that. Another ETH gold video. That's the rage right now. If you're not in ETH gold, then you are missing out on record breaking daily, daily movement. As this thing, I'll just quickly see here. Look at that. Boom. But that's not the point of this video. I want to provide you the latest on some platforms such as Kangai. So courtesy, I got to give credit to Crypto Don on this one. Let me see here. I got to look for it. Here we go. The CEO says that starting tonight, can God is implementing a new payment system, so hopefully everything will go smoothly with the payments. He also said that he's hiring a group of experts in the field to help accelerate the transactions stuck in the mempool. Once again, he assured everybody that we'll be paid. He just asked for patience as he tries to solve the issues. He will have a Zoom call with English speakers on Wednesday. Um... So that'll be next Wednesday since today's already Friday when this announcement was made. So with that, we'll see what happens with this thing. Uh, I've received all my withdrawals up to date. When you look at all the withdrawals and hashtag, you know, transaction hash. I almost said hashtag, but um, everything's been paid. You know, everything's been applied and paid. Uh... There were a couple of times that programs and then it ended up coming through. Um, these smaller ones came, usually come through pretty quick. It's the bigger ones, which is not even not, you know, it's not that big would be stuck from time to time. And so, uh, we'll see what happens. So probably by next week, I'll be able, on Tuesday, I'll be able to meet that cutoff once again, because you got to have a hundred plus to meet the cutoff time. For can got in order to hit the automatic withdrawal that they put out there so with that if people start seeing that all right now everybody's getting their transactions there's no more mempool issues and things are being paid out in a timely manner there could you know possibly be some potential interest in this thing once again as in it will crank that wheel in motion and get things going again you know get that ball rolling once again because it's not a bad platform uh it's just the whole payout system was so convoluted and the amount of steps it has to go through just to even get to the end point of which is you receive your payment with an email there was just so many steps involved in doing that. And one thing they haven't done is they've always paid it. It just gets stuck in this whole mempool thing. Uh, if you believe in mempool, which I guess they show that there could be mempool issues and all that. Uh, with, you know, transactions being super slow in the blockchain and all that. And notably, you know, since the Bitcoin happening, uh, it's kind of happened that way so we'll see what happens with this as uh next tuesday uh we'll see if i make that cut off or if um you know you got some new people that come in under me on, on my team 
then those are usually payments that will come through and I'll be notified of that. So as you can see, since they're based in Mexico, a lot of the volume is right here in North America. It's funny how there's really none in Mexico, even though it's based, well, it's not really, it's based in Texas, but it's close to Mexico. But there's really none in Mexico. But, uh, yeah, all of North America is pretty covered, uh, except for the edges of Alaska there. Even Hawaii's covered. Uh, I thought it's kind of funny there. And then you got this whole area of, like, Eastern Europe and the Middle East, which is kind of interesting. A little part of, I don't know what that is, Philippine Islands, maybe? And uh, Northern Europe, so... That's where the, uh, a lot of the volumes are. So Northern Europe, see like France. Uh, looks like it's one of the bigger ones there. Ireland. I think that's IR Ireland. Oh yeah, Philippines. So yeah, that's definitely Philippines there. Big, big number there. And of course, US. So, kind of interesting how everything's spread out. Now let's take a look at the latest on, uh, let's see here. Oh, Battalion. This thing has been a, a, a slow grower. Uh, they've had some webinars this week. Notably, uh, Jim Cathcart, if you like the, you know, if you like him as a motivational speaker, uh, he's been on board with this thing and been motivationally speaking to everybody to motivate you about putting this thing out there. Um, so, Let's see what this is here. Message from CEO. See if anything new here. I have a special message from our CEO. He recorded it especially for you in English, French, and Italian. So you could do that. This was posted, oh, this was posted a couple days ago. So if you want to see that, uh, I don't know if I want to watch it right now. I got things to cover. But this is where I'm at right now. If there's something already in the main wall, it means that someone must have come in under me. So I just want to say thank you. And this is Lock Funds is the daily profit that you get out of it. And so, so far it says 1.33%. That was yesterday. And it's been hovering around the same marks the whole time. Um, we'll see what happens with that. Currently at 4% of this uh, circle. And I guess... The reward for here, once you hit this, is an iPhone 11. I have an iPhone 10, so not a big deal to me, but, you know, that's just something, I guess. And uh, it's paid out so far. Every time I've taken a withdrawal, it's paid out. So, like, for example, this uh, 61 right here. And... Um, Looks like they've kind of changed the way you could look at your history here. So we got 61, and then uh, yeah, they've really changed how this thing is here. So, hmm. You go back to here, and. Uh, stretch out the dates to see how this thing covers. Ah, I'm not going to mess with it right now, but but uh, I've taken uh, withdraws when I can because I don't hit enough sometimes every week and uh, I just take it for what I get out of it. So when you look at the history here, or I'm sorry, wallets, out of the 1,001 packages that I've achieved thus far, I've been in it since uh, the 210 day mark, which was uh, like end of April, or I'm sorry, end of May. <laughs> um, so you can see it's been roughly, what, 36 days? Yeah, 36 days there. And I've accumulated $321 thus far. It's kind of a cool counter. And... Um, yeah, so that's what's been going on with Battalion. It's going. It's currently went up 1%. No, so they're at 74% on their market opening progress. 
towards this whole uh, exchange thing. So we'll see what happens. Let me move on to, here's something interesting. So Finalmente has been doing these airdrops here of this globe coin. And this is supposed to be tied to Finalmente, which is uh, makes you wonder. I have to close it off because the music is so loud in the background you can't even turn it off. But they've been doing these airdrops of these Final Mente coins. They so they call it Globe Coin. Makes you wonder: coins, free airdrops. What does this mean? Does this mean that potentially something may happen soon with that platform? Because why would they have their own coin out of nowhere? And this makes you wonder, could there be something more out of it soon? Could there be meaning that it could convert over to a globe coin exchange or some sort of way they pay out in this globe coin thing? Makes you wonder about that one. So just throwing that out there since they're doing this whole airdrop out of nowhere. Um, and then you have this secondary platform because this is a BTC platform you have a secondary one that is final mint a main that caters towards the altcoins uh, version and some B BTC with it too it's a little bit more improved uh, on the final mint a original so it makes you wonder why are they doing all these moves you know because I mean when you look at it there hasn't been a whole lot of traction if you only have 6,000 users and and 333 days i don't care what the guy said there's a guy that commented saying oh ever since january when they did this this and this i don't know why does it say 333 days online so just saying and when you look at the notable names all i see are bloods they're notable names in this thing so just throwing that out there and uh as an honorable mention let me go back out here. Let's see. This one right here. They made an announcement in Telegram. Thought it was kind of interesting. That, uh. Yeah, whatever on this stuff. This is, they made a little bit of an announcement. To me, it was pretty cryptic. Ha, <laughs> crypto, get it? But, um. It was just kind of put out there, and they haven't really said nothing since. Tomorrow there will be an update in the website. Platform users do not have to be affected with the official statement here. So, I don't know. This this whole exchange thing is looming, right? Didn't they talk about having an exchange in June? This was announced months ago, but nothing yet. And so it makes you wonder what's happening over here, huh? Just, just throwing out some things, you know, just to keep in mind, you know, that people may be forgetting about what's happening. So you got this stuff happening with all these platforms right now. And so that's all I wanted to cover on this as... uh Got a little bit more on this to talk about, maybe in a whole separate video that I may allude to. And so we'll see what happens with that. All I got to say is, um, to a comment I got is, who are you? I mean, like, that's all I got to say is, who, who are you? You know, like, who do you to say what? Uh, you know, the explanation to me about how things are and all that. So that's all I got to say about that. I'll touch more about it in another video. But, um, yeah, comment down below. Let me know what you think about all this stuff here. So you got Can God update. Kind of let you fill in on uh, what I've been talking about, you know, what's been going on with Battalion. I touched on some things that might be looming with uh, Mind Capital and Final Mente. And a little bit of a teaser with 3x Capital. So, yeah, comment down below. Let me know what you think. I got links down below for everything I'm in. And uh, other than that, I'll see you in the next one.